Bruce Davey, the CTO of networking at VMware. But what we found in the early days of network virtualization was that many people who were starting to try to automate their data centers, they found that they could provision compute resources fairly quickly, thanks to the, the wonders of server virtualization, but that networking was still the long pole when it came to provisioning services in a data center. He showed the one button deployment of a bunch of virtual machines connected into a rich topology. And that's the sort of thing that we can do with network virtualization. I wanted to talk about distributed load balancing, you know, as we go from the second tier to the third tier, we can still do the same sort of thing through the NSX vSwitch, it's just that we're now applying a slightly different set of criteria. I do want you to understand the, the fundamental capabilities of NSX that differentiate this platform from anything else out there in the marketplace. The fact that we implement features in software in a fully distributed way, and the way we can keep on adding those, we can do it in vSphere hypervisors, in open source hypervisors, and if you saw Guido Appenzeller's talk yesterday, he even showed off how we can start doing it for containers and for public cloud workloads.